In this video, I will show you how to create some handwritten text for your videos and you don't have to use any specific video editor to do this. So let's head into this website right now. And the website that you want to go to is called calligrapher.ai. So what Calligrapher AI does is actually to create handwriting text. So the way to do it is at the bottom here at the screen, you can uh, type in some text. I'm going to just do it here. Right. And at the top, you have the option to select your speed, the legibility and the stroke width. Okay. And there's also a bunch of style that you can use over here that you can choose. So at the default, it is actually just a blank slate. From what I found, the best way is actually to have the speed right at the minimum and to increase your stroke width to somewhere around uh, towards say about approximately 70% and you can also dial up the legibility as well. Once you're alright, just click on uh, write. Now you also have to make sure that you have a screen recording software and uh, the reason why we're going to use a screen recording is that we will record the screen as uh, Calligrapher AI writes the text. If you don't know what screen recording software to use, uh, check out the link uh, towards the end of the video or also in the description, but do that after you've finished watching this video. What you want to do next is to click on right at the bottom here, the bottom right corner, right, right, right. Okay, let's just click on right. And you see that Calligrapher is writing this text down. Now, if you're happy, you can just go with it. If you want to have a different style, just click on write again. And uh, the software here will actually write it under a different style. You can do it as many times as you like. Uh, remember to just run your screen capture so that uh, your text is captured so that you can actually import it into your video editor later. Once this is done, what you want to do is go into your screen recording software and drop it into uh, your video editor. Now for this tutorial, I will use a shortcut, but you can actually use any video editing software that allows you to do keying or chroma keying. I brought in the section that I wanted into shortcut and this is what it looks like. The first thing that you want to do is to add another video track and I'm going to move this up to the track V2 and you'll see shortly why. And the next step that you want to do is to add a filter. First filter that you want to use is actually the chroma filter. And we can actually just use the simple one. And key out the section that we do not want. And we're going to key out the white color here. Let's open the file so that we can see what's at the bottom. Let's look at this one here. Now straight away, you can see this, another day in lockdown. So let's just pause it. Now you notice that there are things here from the screen capture and we need to remove all those uh, icons that's from my screen. And the way to go about it is to add a filter and this time we will add a mask. Okay, we'll mask out the uh, things that we do not want. All right, and we just want to want the text in the center. So what we want to do is to uh, increase the width so that the mask increases in size. The next thing that we need to do is to change the operation of this uh, mask from override to minimum. Now this is at the top here, so I'm just going to move the text to adjust this so that the text starts earlier and ends earlier. I hope that you liked the video. If you like it, do give it a thumbs up. Check out my other tutorials on using shortcut on the screen right now. I also have a video that shows you what screen recording software that you can use. And if you want to find out more about costs on using various video editing software, do check out the link in the description below.